Praise God. Praise the mighty Jesus. Children of God, wherever you are, uh, kindly rise up your feet. Let us continue to, let us thank, to, to thank the Lord. Let us give him more the praise. Let us give him more the glory. Let us thank him for making it possible for you and I to be here this evening. Let us thank him for his mercy over our lives. Let us thank him for his grace. Let us thank him for his compassion. Let us thank him for his faithfulness. Let us magnify his name. Let us thank him for our gathering this evening. Father, we thank you. Blessed be thy holy name. Lord, we thank you. We give you all the praise. We give you all the glory. We magnify your holy name. Lord, we cannot thank you enough, even though we have 10,000 tongues, Lord. We are not enough to thank you this evening for all your goodness in our lives, for your faithfulness, for your love, for your kindness. Lord, we thank you. 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 Our Father and Omega, we thank you. Father, we thank you. King of kings, the lion of the tribe of Judah, Lord, we appreciate you. We magnify your holy name. Lord, we thank you. We are grateful, oh Lord. We are grateful, Lord. We are grateful, oh Lord. For all you have done for us. Hallelujah. We are grateful, O oh Lord. We are grateful, Lord. We are grateful, O oh Lord. We are grateful, O oh Lord. For all you have done for us. Hallelujah. We are grateful, O oh Lord. We are grateful, Lord. We are grateful, O oh Lord. We are grateful, Lord. We are grateful, O oh Lord. For all you have done for us. Hallelujah. We are grateful, O oh Lord. Thank you, thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for everything you have done. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for everything you have done. Amen. Wherever you are, children of God, let us open our mouth and begin to confess all our sins unto him, that in every area that we sin against him, let us pray unto him that, Lord, in every area we've sinned against you, every known sin and unknown sin, even sins of our parents, our ancestral sin, even sins of the nation, any sins that might hinder our gatherings this evening, or that might help block the heaven of our gatherings tonight, this evening. Let us say, blood of Jesus, wash them away. Blood of Jesus, wash them away. Blood of Jesus, wash them away. Blood of Jesus, cleanse us. Blood of Jesus, cleanse those sins. Blood of Jesus, cleanse those sins. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Let us also pray like this. Bible says, mercy triumphs over judgment. Let us pray like this. Mercy of God overshadow all our unfaithfulness. 
Dama in our garden this evening. In the name of Jesus, mercy of God, overshadow all our faithfulness. Dama in our gatherings tonight. In the name of Jesus, mercy of God, mercy of God, overshadow, 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 overshadow all our faithfulness or any of faithfulness. Dama in our gatherings this evening. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Let us also pray like this. Mercy of God, overshadow our gatherings tonight. In the name of Jesus, mercy of God, overshadow our gathering this evening. In the name of Jesus, mercy of God, overshadow, overshadow our gathering, overshadow our gathering, overshadow our gathering this evening. In the name of Jesus, mercy of the Most High God, overshadow our garden this evening. In the name of Jesus, overshadow, 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 overshadow. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Let us also pray like this. Any satanic gathering against our garden this evening, you are failed. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Any satanic gathering, any evil gathering, Against our garden this evening, you are filled. Scatter in the name of Jesus. 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 Any satanic garden, evil congregation against our garden this evening, you are filled. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Evil agenda. Evil program against our service tonight, against the heaven of our prayers tonight. Be cancelled and be nullified with the blood of Jesus. Be cancelled and be nullified with the blood of Jesus. Be cancelled and be nullified with the blood of Jesus. Be cancelled and be nullified with the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Let us pray like this. Oh God, arise and take over tonight's gathering. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise tonight and take over tonight's gathering. In the name of Jesus, take over tonight's gathering with your wonderful hand. In the name of Jesus, take over tonight's gathering. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and take over tonight's gathering with your wonderful hand. In the name of Jesus, take over tonight's gathering. Take over tonight's gathering. Take over tonight's gathering. Take over tonight's gathering. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Let us also pray like this. My Father, here I am this evening. Have mercy upon my life. In the name of Jesus, ancient of this, here we are this evening. Have mercy upon our lives this evening. In the name of Jesus, have mercy upon our lives. Have mercy upon our lives. Have mercy upon our lives. I miss upon our lives. I miss upon our lives. I miss upon our lives. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Ancient of days, arise and dispatch your necessary angels in tonight's gathering. In the name of Jesus, in tonight's gathering, dispatch the necessary angels for tonight's gathering. In the name of Jesus, ancient of days, arise in your mercy. And dispatch the necessary angels for tonight's service. In the name of Jesus, dispatch them, dispatch them, dispatch them, dispatch them, dispatch them, dispatch them, the necessary angels for tonight's gathering. Oh God, arise and dispatch them. In the name of Jesus, dispatch them. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Holy Ghost, arise this evening and take preeminent of tonight's gathering in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, arise and take preeminent of tonight's gathering in the name of Jesus. Take over tonight's gathering in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, be at the front of tonight's gathering in the name of Jesus. Take over tonight's gathering in the name of Jesus. Take over tonight's gathering. In the name of Jesus, take over tonight's garden. In the name of Jesus, go ahead of us. In the name of Jesus, 
take over tonight's gathering in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Let us also pray like this. Grace of God, arise and manifest your wonders in tonight's service. In the name of Jesus, grace of God, arise and manifest your, sign, your wonders in tonight's service. In the name of Jesus, grace arise and manifest your power, manifest your wonders. In tonight's gathering, in the name of Jesus, manifest, 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 manifest. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Children of God, let us continue. Let us start to play the blood of Jesus over this place, over this environment. We play the blood of Jesus over our gatherings tonight. We play the blood of Jesus. Over this place, over this environment, over our garden this evening. We play the blood of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Amen. Let us start to worship the Lord. Let us start to worship Him. Let us give him all the praise. Let us give him all the glory. Let us adore his holy name. Let us thank him. Children of God for making it possible for you and I to be here this evening. It's not by our power, nor by our might. Let us thank him for his kindness. Let us thank him for his faithfulness. Let us thank him for his love. Let us thank him for what he's going to do in our midst this evening. Let us adore his holy name. Let us thank him. Lord, we thank you. Ancient of this. Lord, we thank you. 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 Lord, we magnify your holy name. Blessed be the holy name. We thank you for preserving our lives. We thank you for shielding us from the enemy. We thank you for frustrating their evil agenda over our lives. We thank you for frustrating their evil plans. We thank you because their agenda did not come to pass over our lives. Lord, we thank you because their expectation did not come to pass over our lives. Lord, we thank you for fighting our battles. Lord, we thank you for defending your purpose in our lives. We thank you for shielding us. We thank you for providing for our needs. We thank you for sustaining us. Sustaining us. We thank you for healing us. We thank you. We thank you. If not for you, what shall we be saying by now? If not for you, so many of us, we should be in the mortuary by now. If not for you, so many of us supposed to be on the hospital bed by now. If not for you, so many of us may be supposed to be in the prison. If not for you, so many of us, we are nowhere to be found by now. Lord, we thank you. We are aware of our surroundings. Lord, we magnify your holy name. Right from the top of our head to the sole of our feet, we are expressing our gratitude unto you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Ancient of this, Lord, we thank you. Mighty man of war, Lord, we thank you. I am that I am, Lord, we thank you. The consuming fire, Lord, we thank you. Elohim, Adonai, Lord, we thank you. Unquestionable God, Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Confident keeping God, Lord, we thank you. The one that never sleep, never slumber, Lord, we thank you. Blessed be the holy name. We thank you for tonight's gathering, O oh Lord. We thank you because our coming here this evening will never be in vain. Lord, we thank you. We magnify your holy name. Blessed be the 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 holy name. Glorious God. Blessed be the holy name. Blessed be the holy name. Rock of ages. Blessed be the holy name. Blessed be the holy name. Come better keeping God. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. If we look to our left, Lord, we are saying thank you. If we look to our right, Lord, we are saying thank you. If we look back, Lord, we are saying thank you. Even if we look ahead of us, Lord, we are saying we are glorifying your holy name. Lord, we thank you. Blessed be the holy name. Blessed be the holy name. Blessed be the holy name. In all things, Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. 
I am that I am. Lord, we glorify your holy name. Blessed be the holy name. Beginning and the end. Blessed be the holy name. The one that was, that is, that is to come. Blessed be the holy name. Lord, we thank you. We glorify your holy name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Adonai, Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. The fourth man in the fire. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Please survey the holy name. Thank you, thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for everything you have done. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for everything you have done. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for everything you have done. We are saying. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, our Lord. We are saying thank you, Jesus. Thank you, our Lord. We are saying thank you, Jehovah. Thank you, our Lord. We are saying thank you, Jesus. Thank you, our Lord. We are saying thank you, Jehovah. Thank you, our Lord. We are saying thank you, Jesus. Thank you, our Lord. Ancient of days, as old as you are. As old as you are, hallelujah, you will never change. Ancient of days, ancient of days. As old as you are, as old as you are, hallelujah, you will never change. You will never change. Ancient of days. As old as you are, as old as you are, hallelujah, you will never change. Ancient of days, ancient of days, as old as you are, as old as you are, hallelujah, you will never change. All, all the gods, they are the works of men. You are the only one. There is none like you. All, all the gods, all, all the gods, they are the works of men. You are the only one. Jehovah, there is no light. Oh, Lord, I go on all the gods. They are the works of men. You are the only one. Jehovah, there is no light. Unchangeable, unchangeable God. Unchangeable God, unchangeable, unchangeable God, unchangeable God, unchangeable, unchangeable God, unchangeable God, unchangeable, unchangeable God. Unchangeable God, unchangeable, unchangeable God. Unchangeable God, unchangeable, unchangeable God. Reliable God, reliable, 
Continue to thank him. Let us continue to appreciate him. Let's give him all the glory. Let us thank him. Let us thank him. Let us thank him. Beloved, let us appreciate him. He is worthy to be glorified. He is worthy to be adored. Beloved, let us thank our Father in heaven. What a wonderful day. The first day in the month of November. This is the 11th month in year 2022. Beloved, just like yesterday, 10 months gone already. And I'm believing God on your behalf. Like if it is in his coming, beloved, you are going to see the month of December in Jesus' name. Now, just in the month of December, you will see the beginning, you will see the end in the name of Jesus. When the people of God are shouting Happy New Year, you will now be found wanting in the name of Jesus. Beloved, I pray. But this month of November shall be a special month in your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. If other are missing anything this month, you will be meeting the right people in the name of Jesus. Amen. Your angel of blessing, your angel that will lead you out of your wilderness, Amen. that same angel you will encounter in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray and I decree that in this month of November, you shall move from power to power and from strength to strength in the name of Jesus. Amen. In this month of November, men and women shall go out of their way to favor you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray and I decree that this month of November we cooperate for your upliftment in the name of Jesus. Amen. For all you chase from January to October ended that you were unable to achieve. Before the end of second week of November, you will achieve that thing in the name of Jesus. Amen. Book of remembrance, book of unusual favor shall be open unto you in this month in the name of Jesus. Amen. As today mark the first day in the month of November 2022, today shall mark the day of your goodness and enlightenment in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray and I decree that it shall be well with you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Any evil attached to this month of November shall not come near you and your dwelling in the name of Jesus. Amen. If you will receive any visitor this month, it shall be for testimony of a breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Amen. People will not gather to weep in your house at your home in the name of Jesus. Amen. If people are coming to you, I pray and I decree that they are coming to celebrate the goodness of God with you and your household in the name of Jesus. Amen. I stand here as an oracle of God and I decree that your heaven will remain permanently open throughout this month in the name of Jesus. Amen. Because whether you believe it or not, I pray and I decree that in this month of November, it shall be well with you. Amen. It shall be well with your loved ones. Amen. It shall be well with all that concerns you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Beloved, wherever you are, just continue to say thank you, Jesus. 
Continue to appreciate him for today. Being the first day in the month of November, thank him. Thank him. Give him all the glory. 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 Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you. Blessed be your name. Blessed be your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. In Jesus' name, we thank you. Amen. All the glory must be to the Lord, to the Lord, for he is worthy of our praise. No man on earth should give glory to himself, or the glory must be to the Lord, or the glory, or the glory must be to the Lord, to the Lord, for he is worthy of our praise. No man on earth should give glory to himself. All the glory must be to the Lord. Unto the Lord be the glory. Great things he has done. Unto Jesus be the glory. Great things he has done unto the Lord. Be the glory. Great things he has done unto the Lord. Be the glory. Great things he has done. Great things he has done. Greater things he will do. Unto the Lord be the glory, great things he has done, great things he has done, greater things he will do. Unto the Lord be the glory, great things he has done. You know, I just look like I continue to say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Those that are better than you and I, beloved, today they are no more. Here we are. We are still standing. We are still standing. Beloved, many of us far, we fought some unusual battle. And here we are, we are still standing before him. There are some of us spiritually, beloved, but our God did not allow them to overrun us. Let us thank him. Let us give him all the glory. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Ancient of day, we thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ancient of days, as so as you are. As so as you are. You will never change. Ancient of the Ancient of days, I saw as you are, I saw the sure. You will never see. Ancient of days, ancient of days, I saw as you are, I saw as you are. Hallelujah. You will never change. A shant of the ancient of the as old as you are. As old as you are. Hallelujah. You will never change. Our Father and our God, we want to thank you. The Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, we appreciate you. The beginning and the end of everything, we thank you. The one that was that he is and that will continue to be, we bless your holy name. Alpha and the Omega, we thank you. 
The captain of the ship of our life will praise your holy name. The one that has been even before anything, blessed be your name. Lord, we want to thank you tonight for the guiding of your children, those in the church and those connected to this service. And those that will be watching this program later. Father, we say thank you on behalf of everybody for giving us this wonderful privilege even to see the month of November. Father, be thou exalted in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lord Jesus, as the entrance of your war, give it life. And, the, and it also give it understanding even to the simple. We are here to learn from your feet once again. Open our eyes of, our eyes of understanding in the name of Jesus. Let the power and the anointing of your heart break every shackle of ignorance in our lives in the name of Jesus. Amen. At the end of everything, Lord, let us have reason even to say the, to say big thank you unto you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Unto you be the glory. In Jesus' mighty and wonderful name, we are praying. Amen. 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 Jesus. You know, wherever you are connected to this program, God bless you. Those from Nigeria, those in the UK, and every other part of the world, we thank you for joining us. Beloved, we want to continue what we started last week. If I'm able to finish tonight, good. If not, I'll continue another day. What I know is that by his grace, I will not be able to continue next week. Uh, but let's see what we can do tonight. Beloved, we want to continue the teaching titled, Answer Me by Voice, O Lord. Answer Me by Voice, O Lord. Last week we read from the book of Exodus, chapter 19, from verse, verse 1 to 20. Chapter 19, verse 1 to 20, where the Lord answered Moses by voice, where he spoke to him in a clear language. And beloved, we look out when we say, answer me, and we ask God to answer us by voice. I don't want to be discussing what is voice or what is the word answer again. But we say when we ask God to answer us by, we ask, we ask God to answer us by, what are we talking about? We say, we are telling God to talk to us in a clear voice. When we ask, ask him to talk, to answer us by voice, what are we saying? We are telling him to decode mysteries to us. When we say he should answer us by voice, what are we saying? We are telling him to talk to us in a clear language, in a clear language. When we ask him to answer us by voice, we are telling him to unravel mysteries. When we are telling him to talk to us or to answer by voice, what are we saying? We are telling him to explain deep things to us. When we ask him to answer us by voice, what are we saying? We are asking God to reveal unknown secrets to us. We are asking him to reveal unknown secrets. That means secret things belong to him. And that one which he wish he revealed unto us is of it. You know, secret things belong to God. Beloved, by his grace, I've been, uh, one way or the other, a custodian of secrets. Things that I will tell people that people will be wondering, say, are you sure of what you're saying? And which I'm very sure of what I'm saying. When you are asking God to answer you by voice, what are you saying? You are telling God to tell you what you ought to know. There are things you need to know. I always tell people, everyone, one of women, we all want to fly. But most of the time, we don't ask for where we are landing. And that's the reason you see people <laughs> saying, I die no, after a lot of events. We all want to fly. We all want to, <laughs> to just jump up and say, I said, flying. But do you know, when you fly, when you fly, a time is coming that you want to land. But do you ask God, say, Father, where am I going to man? Many who wants to do business. They are not asking God, do you want me to do this business? They just see people doing it. And they too, they started doing the same thing. At the end of the day, what people are doing and they are making profit, they will do it and they will come back with <laughs> debt that they cannot even explain. Many just discover that people are getting married. When they want to do their own, they never ask questions. Beloved, I always call marriage black market, where you don't know. Nobody, one of a woman can tell you, this thing I want to buy, I know all the secrets about it. When it's this black market, 
you only get into it and the thing will not be unraveling itself one way or the other. Even marriage of 20, 30 years, don't, de don't deceive yourself. You cannot tell me you've known your husband and your wife. <laughs> uh, more, <laughs> more, you've known everything about your wife or your husband. You've known everything. No, it's not possible. Beloved, some situation will arise and you will see another color. Yes. Yes. Do you know the one that is kissing you today? Saying, darling, sweetheart, cockroach in my cupboard, the, rat, the only rat in my brain, the only rat will always scatter things. Is, uh, when things are going very well, is the one scattering your head. The other one saying, yes, calling your sort of name, can come back to deny you later. An old man was telling me something that today when I heard what the woman did to her husband. I said, I don't need to pray, but God is coming back to deal with her. Whatever the man may, might have done, you know, it's not something I can be telling you. That's the reason I, I always say, tell my people, what I'm listening to every now and then, some I can say, some I cannot say. Beloved, when you are asking God to answer you, what are you saying? You are telling God to shine light into the darkness of your life. Beloved, do you know, everybody will always experience our our, our own darkness. And yet, there was a time Jesus got to that level and he said to them, this is your hour. Uh, <laughs> that is a time of where the kingdom of darkness will be reigning and ruling. There's nothing you can do. There is no body born of a woman that is immune against problem. Yes, one day you will just see, no matter how, how much you can pray, no matter how, you know, <laughs> at least you remember what happened to that father in the Lord. Was it last year? Yeah? Baba, our father in the Lord, the one who did him. Mm. Do you know some people? They were now mocking him. They did not know that nobody, uh, they were mocking that old man at that age, mocking their own. Mocking their own future. What will lead some people to empire? Nobody, beloved. Nobody. At that time, when the man and the old woman was passing through, instead of them to be consoling about somewhere, saying some things that you can never imagine, God will help them and God will forgive them in Jesus' name. Amen. Beloved, nobody. There is always a time of darkness and a kingdom of darkness. Yes, when they arrested Jesus, that time was so dark. I would say darkness covered the earth. The whole, the whole earth was filled and full with darkness. Beloved, don't deceive yourself. No matter, no matter how righteous you are, time will come like that. And when you find yourself in such a situation, that is when you need to ask God, say, Father, answer me by voice. I've been in that situation before. Where people that are even supposed to be helping me, like they want to maintain me. Do you know, tongue and mouth can keep more than anything. And people gather together and they were saying what I did not even know anything about. You think it's easy for somebody's wife to die? And people gather and say, you are the one that killed, killed her. And some even say, they are. yeah, we knew what was happening. He has been sleeping with one lady in the hotel. They've been going there, two of them conspired together to kill her. And the person they were even talking about, <laughs> I've never met her before. <laughs> Until recently, I would not want to mention the sister. Then I go to her and I was telling her, said, you know, during that time, some people were saying, they even went to some prophet. See, help us tell it that we're the right person. And I said, Pastor, you had it. She now said, one of my friends came to me. Is there any way you can just face me with this man? The one that is tall. And I said, you that you cannot even play. You that you're not born again. You want to marry Pastor. You will destroy him. He said, I don't care. Just look for a way of matching me with him. And I told her, I said, I had everything. We had those with three children. Four children, I said, they are the one God that's facing for me. Go with them. I'm not saying they should not get married. But why? <laughs> Let me leave that one. Now. When you ask asking God to answer you by force, what are you saying? You are telling God to expose hidden things to you. Hidden things. Hidden things. When you are telling God, answer me by what are you saying? You are telling God to give you answer of peace concerning a certain situation. Beloved, there will be a time that you find yourself in a situation that you need answer of peace. Anything that is not answer of peace at that time can lead one into problem. Uh, beloved, then we talk about ways in which God answer his children. We only mention one, but let's go to the Bible before we continue. Numbers chapter 12. 
Numbers chapter 12. This is not a message we need to watch. If I need to preach it seven, five, six, but I'm not continuing this week, I'm going to take off. Those in the house know what is happening. Numbers chapter 12. And I'll be reading from verse 1. And he goes, us, say, and Miriam and Aaron spake against Moses because of the Ethiopian woman whom he had married. For he had married an Ethiopian woman. Because the Lord said, if you want to marry as an, as an Hebrew, yes, or uh, yes, as an, as an Israel, you need to choose where you will marry from. Don't just marry anybody. But Mr. Moses just speak from Ethiopia and go marry to the woman. And the brother and the sister, they, they look at him and start talking. They forgot that Moses is not just ordinary person, but a special being. Beloved, the, the case I mentioned earlier on, some people are still, they are still not seeing the word. But when they started tormenting me, I said, Father, what should I do? He said, my son, pray. And ask the serpent of judgment to bite them. And I prayed. And the serpent bite, he bit some people because they were tormenting me. And many of them, we did not even <laughs> have anything to do together. I said to some of them, where were you? So I said, I'm a friend. I said, who is your friend? Your friend that has visited that you don't know? I've never seen you in my house before. And I said, my wife is your friend. Where? How? I met one about a month ago after nine years. Even she did not know how to greet me. I was the one that called her. I said, how are you, ma? Are you okay? She said, God bless you. They, 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 they gather and they say they are supporting a dead person. Will you be fighting a living one because of a dead person? Huh? I was saying, and Miriam and Aaron spake against Moses because of the Ethiopian woman whom he had married. For he had married an Ethiopian woman. And they said, are the Lord in this spoken only by Moses? <laughs> Beloved, God truly speaks to all his children. But beloved, there are categories of, of speaking to each other. Uh, some will be there one week, they've not had anything. But some will need them within 10 seconds. God has already spoken to them. So when you come to, when it is things of God, there is what? Favorite in it. You see, Esau, I hate. And who? Jacob, I love. Then, are you not going to say there's partiality with God? That's to tell you, they are his favorite when it comes to this of God. He said unto Lot and his family, say, you dare not look back. If you try it, something will happen. And Lot's wife looked back. And she turned to what? Pillars of salt. The same place God asked them not to look. Mr. Abraham stood afar off and was watching what was happening. Life and the rest, and nothing happened to him. That's to tell you, beloved, we can be what? Church mates, but we are not what? Grace mates. Yes. It doesn't matter. Somebody, they can be calling somebody pastor. And the member, I'm not saying because of that, you see this one and say, no, no, no. A member can have grace more than even a pastor. I've told you before. The church was booming. Everything was booming. And suddenly, things were as cold as, as what? As dead stone. And the pastor said, look, what is happening? I've not committed anything. I've not done anything. And he went to God say, Father, please, the church is not going in like before. What is happening? God spoke to the pastor and said, look, there, <clears throat> there was a woman in this church which all of you failed to reckon with, an old woman. That the woman has been the backbone of this ministry. She's the one that has been praying, doing everything. And you believe you're the one doing it. And the woman passed on and you did not even show any concern. You people did not even organize anything for her because you believe she was nobody. That she was the one that has been praying. All you've been, all the things you've been doing, you believe you're the one doing it. You are not the one. So when I'm talking about grace, it doesn't say it's, a, it's only pastor. I have a lot of people. They are only getting about with title. They do if you are a spiritual person and you have spiritual spectacle, you know, there's spiritual spectacle. Which you can use to what? To size somebody. When you size them, you know they are not even in the spirit at all. But when you see them, you love them so much. You give me, me them father, 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 have a father. Your daughter is here, your daughter is here. Have a father. Your son is here, your son is here. Lay hands upon me, lay hands upon me. And the one that is laying hands upon you is one with that his hand is full of, of dead deities. I say, I receive it. He said to me, I drink it and I swallow it. God bless you. I know some people will be laughing. <laughs> 
<laughs> and they said, Are the Lord in this book only by Moses? Are he not spoken also by us? And the Lord had it. <laughs> so, is it only that is prophesying? We too, we know how to do it. Eh? And Bible said, and the Lord had it. And verse 3. Now the man Moses was very meek above all the men which were upon the face of the earth. So, as at that time, even with his anger, the heaven says is the most meekest person before God. That's why don't stay somewhere and be judging the case you don't know anything about God. So you don't kill yourself. Huh? <laughs> and when the Bible says the most big person upon the earth, that means maybe as of that time they have one billion population. Bible says Moses is the number one. When it comes to score of meekness, Moses is the number one. And this is the man that God has said, look, just speak unto the what? The rock. The rock. And he hit Jesus on the edge. And the God is still saying is the most meekest person. So you are not. There are cases you can judge, and there are cases you cannot put your hand on. And the Lord speaks suddenly unto Moses and unto Aaron and unto Miriam. Say, come out, you three, unto the tabernacle of the congregation. That's another thing. Because that your younger brother and younger sister, <laughs> and you call out my younger sister, and that person is now a pastor or a prophet. And I say, what is it? And, uh, when you look at it, the hierarchy, or, or, or the, the, this family, when you look at the family tree, my branch sprung up before you. What do you mean? Sit down there. No, it doesn't work like that. He called out the Lord of them. Say, come out, you three, unto the tabernacle of the congregation. And they, and they three came out. Verse 5. And the Lord came down in the pillar of the cloud and stood in the door of the tabernacle and called Aaron and Miriam. And they both came. God appeared physically to them. Say, come, 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 come. You've done something. I want to talk to you. And he said, hear yeah, now my, my words. If there be a prophet among you, that is, if there's any prophet among you, I, the Lord, will make myself known unto him in a vision. And we speak, in, speak unto him in a what? In a dream. That if there's any prophet among you, I, the Lord, will talk to him in what? In vision and in a dream. Say, my servant, Moses, is not so... Who is faithful in you know my house? That is, this one is a faithful one. You know what? He said, with him, we now speak mouth to mouth. We are talking about what? Speak. Eh? Answer me by, me by what? By voice. And this is God talking. I say, when it comes to Moses, I will talk to Moses, and Moses will talk back. We talk mouth by mouth. Well, that is still happening. No? I don't want to go into details. If it's not happening in your life, you can say it's not happening, but it's still happening. Where people will be talking and God will be talking back to them. Huh? May you get to that level in Jesus' name. God is still looking for people that he will be talking and he'll be talking to each other. I'm not talking about I perceive, I receive. No, no, I'm not talking about that. The one you will talk, say, Father, what is happening? I need to we talk back to you. Say, son, this is it. Say, Father, I'm about to turn left. You. Say, no, 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 turn right. That you don't need to consult somebody. As I'm my younger brother, <laughs> you know, I have a lot of brothers, a lot of sisters. While he was complaining, I said, Did you ask God about this thing? He said, They said the thing is good. I said, They said, Your father is not talking to you. They said, I said, The person I said, Where is he? He said, He has died. I said, Okay, well, maybe we need to go, to go and, and see where him or where they buried him so that we can ask him. You want to take action that will affect your life for life. He said, They said, who said? <laughs> God will help us. So we think we like speak mouth to mouth, even apparently, and not in dark speeches. That's part of the way God can talk. God can talk in that. But when it comes to Moses, is what is a clear one. Beloved, that is where we are going. We want, beloved, the season we are, you need to be hearing God clearly now. Things are turned upside down. Somebody asked me to ask how much they, they were selling about yesterday. I asked them, I asked some of my friends selling money. They say 95. I say, well, yeah, and this is too expensive. And by two, by two, as I'm talking to them, pounds is about 950. Dollar is about 840. Yes, between yesterday and now, over 60 naira on top. And before the end of this week, it's going to be at least maybe 1,000 to 1,003. 
And some people are dancing, say, yeah, it's up. Yeah, but if you take it to Nigeria, you, you, that, what your parents will buy when it was 250, it will not buy it now. It will not even buy it when it is, it is one million. That might say I'm not talking about changing money or not changing money. Don't say that. I'm only talking that the season we are, this is the season to be yelling go clearly now. This is not season to gamble. Because the little we have, if you gamble with it, <laughs> beloved, mommy end up regretting it. Uh, those things I, I told you, I did I not tell you that towards the end of the year, strange things we have. I told you. Uh, yeah. We have, we have all, of, all of the things on record. That is why we are going to be digging them out. I told you that towards the end of this year, you will see strange things, and we're already in that season. But all I know is my God and your God will sustain us, will back us up, no matter the situation. The things we get out of one anytime from now. The evil apparently are not in that species, and the simile of, of the Lord shall it behold. We are for them, were you not afraid to speak against my servant, Moses? Why are you not afraid? Because you two are hearing little, little voice. And you are now, eh? Malagi, one kill a guinea or Jayoto Lashik will bend this all day. What have, what have you swallowed? When that person is holding gun, are you now open your chest like this? Say fire it. Ah, no. That's mine. And the anger of the Lord was kindled against them and it departed. And you, you know what happened after that? Uh, it's Pierre Aaron. That's why you don't copy people to sin. God's Pierre Aaron. And Bible recorded it as Miriam, leprosy. She was as white as snow. And they sent her out of the out of the camp. Say, go and stay outside. You was uh, and the one they committed to that's another grace. God did not do anything <laughs> for Aaron. So what you don't have grace to carry, don't go and put it on your head though, so that you will not use your bum bum to what to eat the floor. Answer me by voice, oh Lord. Answer me by voice. Then Ways in which God answers his children. That's what we talk about through his words or what? Or scriptures. He talks through scriptures, the true scriptures. He said unto Joshua, Joshua chapter 1 verse 6, that this book of the law must not depart from what? From your mouth. In it meditate in day in day out. Here in it lies your what? Your prosperity. Beloved, the one that will never miss target is the word of God. And I said to you, when I was talking on Sunday, that any case that has been settled in the Bible, no prophet can change it. There are things in the Bible that God has said to it, nothing can change it again. The Bible says he exhort his word more than what is need. So don't deceive yourself. If the case you are seeking the, the face of God for has been settled in the Bible, and you are looking for a way out, you only want to what? To destroy yourself. I told her brother, I said, look, this is what Bible says about what you've done. It was, it was not telling somebody on Sunday again, when I left church, that one sent me a message, even up to yesterday. I said, eh, my pastor, pastor, you know, this one, it seems he, he doesn't want to understand. He doesn't want to do this. I said, leave him alone. He's already on the floor. He's looking for somebody to be on the floor with him. And that will not be there. I can call you my son today. And if, I, if you've done something, which I say, no, it's not that. I can disown you. You to disown me. Abby? Abby? I'm saying the situation. Where somebody say, I disown you, and disown say, me too, I disown you, Father. <laughs> so, <laughs> you're alone. <laughs> if somebody disown you, you to what? Disown him. <laughs> you don't need to grumble. You've done something wrong. And I say, I'm not going to be part of it. You left your wife in problem. And without setting everything, and you say you're not a resident pastor. And you now go, you now, you're about to get married to so acquire it. And the church, they knew that you got what? A wife and children. And they too are saying, let me leave that one, my beloved. Let's go again. How he talks to his people. Let's, let's go into the Bible. And right, today, let's see again hmm. the way in which God talked to his people. Again. 
that will help us all. Beloved, face to face, uh, like he did to Moses, that's another one. God can talk to you what face to face, that is two way communication. You, like I said earlier on, he will be talking to Moses and Moses will be talking back. It has happened before. I don't want to go into details. But I'll be talking to me, and I too will be talking. Like if I'm talking to you as you are sitting down. Say some, this, I'll say no. I'll say no, this is what you want to do. I don't want to go into some, some things tonight. If you want me to share some with you, I'll share it. That particular day, the son, I said, sir, I said, go on three days. I said, pray, I said, no. What did I do? He said, just praise me. And the first night, about to praise him, the only thing changed up. And I said, Father, you asked me to, to praise you. And now you can see what is happening. The what? The center could not hold what? Anything again. Since we're shaking my house already. And I said, Father, you are not a good father. I said it. I need to say something. Don't worry, I'm about to speak to you. I said, what do you want to say again? I said, you asked me to do something. Things are not going according again. I said, I'm not praising you again. You go to your tent, God. I mean, to, I want to be. <laughs> and I said, I mean, I to be on my own. <laughs> and I knelt down. Clearly. And I had it in my head. Say son. I said, sir, I am taking your wife home. I said, you're not, you not doing this. Sir. I started begging. He said, yeah, you're not going to do that. I quickly began, God spoke, and I was now looking for man of, a man of God. I was gathering their picture, time picture with it. I said, no, you're not going to do that. I heard it in my head. He said, I am taking that person one-on-one, -on -one, face to face. There are strange things that <laughs> God will help us. God will help us. Genesis chapter 3, verse 9. And the Bible says, And the Lord God called unto Adam and said unto him, Where art thou? That is not, God wants to see Adam. Because God will always appear to Adam and Eve to come and play with them in the evening. And that particular day, when Adam has taken forbidden fruit, God appeared at the time he normally what? Appeared to them, normally comes to them. And the man Adam was not at the spot. That's the reason. It's very, very dangerous if you face an appointment with God. Say, God, I'm going to be meeting with you every 4 a.m. in the morning. And I said, in my work, no, 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 no. You will not allow your mouth to rush. Don't tell God because whenever you say, God, this is the time we're going to be meeting, God will always be there. No matter how tired you are, at that time, something will say, eh? my friend, Felix, stand up, I am here. And you will not know what happened. All you will know is that you will open your eyes as at that time. When you are used to it, if it is 12 a.m. and you slept 10 minutes to 12, the thing will still continue. This is my son, I am here. And you will not know where this plan will come from. That is what. God will never despise covenant. God will never break any agreement. God shake it very well. It is umami that will always break what? Agreement. God will always uphold covenant. That place you always go to. That the habitation of the what? Of the earth is what is full of currency. And his covenant will remain the same. He will never. He came there and said, Mr. Adam, where are you? And he said to him, say, I heard thy voice. And I was scared. I was afraid. He said, what made you to be what? To be scared. Have you eaten? Are you now telling he that created eyes that you will not see? He that formed the hair you will not He knew what happened. He was only trying to talk to him as a friend. He can, he can strike him immediately. But he, because they are used to each other, they always talk. So he doesn't want, God just wants him. Uh, uh, can you do anything outside God? Many of times uh, I don't want, I don't want that uh, my pastor to know. I don't want that my friend to know. You can hide it from people, but can you hide it from God? 
I don't know, beloved. The way it can speak to you. But you have to say, answer me by voice. You know, by dream. By Genesis 20. Let's see how far we can go before we go into prayer. Genesis 20, verse 6. See, and God said unto him in a dream, to who? Abimelech. Yea, I know that thou didn't did this in the integrity of the heart. For I also will tell thee from sinning against me. Therefore, suffer I thee not to torture. What did, what did he do? He took Abraham's Sarah. wife, Sarah. Well, you know God. By the time the man took Sarah's wife, he sees his eh, sugar cane. The thing will just drop there. He tried to sack it up, nothing happened. And uh, the man, the man said, She's what? She's my sister. my sister. And the man did not know. And God came to him and said to him, Say, Look, I was the one that did not allow your thing to work because I did not want you to sin against me. In, in the dream, clear language, that one, it, the man did not need anybody to explain. God spoke to him clearly. God can talk to you clearly in the dream. When it is Something God wants to reveal. Beloved, you will, you will remember the dream from, from what? From end to from the beginning to the end. You will not. Even in five years, if they ask you, you will still remember because you are there are things that we I will continue telling you. Because I'm talking about that there are some dreams that you you had that they will ask you, what, what is it? When I jump from the top, I jump down and I saw myself in the Kitipupa. From there I go to go taco, you go taco to Yabodi. What is the thing about that? <laughs> When it is real one that God really wants to talk to you, by the time you open your eyes in the morning, you will know this is God. It's not the one they are harassing you. The one they are trying to force feed you. I'm not talking about that one. When it is clear instruction, you will know this is God talking to you. How can he talk to us again, beloved? How can he do that? By open vision. Open vision. Open vision. Act of Apostle, chapter 10. Please be writing all these things down. By what? Open vision. Art chapter 10. Maybe we look one more, then we're going to pray. From verse 1. There was a certain man in Caesarea called Cornelius, a centurion of the band called the what? Italian band, a default man, and one that feared God. Beloved, Say Cornelius, according to the Bible, Cornelius is not what a pastor, a apostle. Cornelius is in a band. That means no matter what you are doing, God, you can still be working for God. You can still be doing. Don't use all those things. It is my job. It is my this. No, 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 beloved. If you are ready, you are ready. When you are ready, God will what? God will give you the strength. Sometimes I don't even know how I'm doing it. I don't even know. I don't know. Sometimes I cannot even explain my schedule. I don't know. But he has been the one that has been doing it at the way that I get straight. See, a default man and one that fear God with all his house. Cornelius is not just the only one. Cornelius makes sure that all what? He makes sure that all his house, they fear God. So don't be the only one that will be serving God and your children will not be serving God. But if you not take it, they the one that will drag you back. Some things will happen. And before you know it, you will see yourself. You will not see that. One of them <laughs> engaged in some things and they ask you to come on Sunday. That if you don't come, they are going to jail because we will not go. So it's better you carry everybody along. A default man and one that fear God with all his house, which gave much arms to people. Cornelius always hear whatever in his hand with people. He doesn't we we tell we told the thing we always share. He gives arms. Some of us to give problem. Do you know what you are giving? God will always bring it back to you. He will always do beloved. Give us. We never lack. Uh, that thing that is telling you don't give, don't give. Only wants to deceive you. Huh? Only want to destroy you. Sorry. Uh, don't give. Uh, the money is not enough. Since you've been keeping it, sir, is it enough? 
Hah? Eh, Jom ni kiri. Ayo naik dulu ni. Kau yang bos. Anuka sis. When you look at that verse too, what they are telling you is they are giving you what qualification of colonials. We gave much arm to the people and pray to God always. Cornelius is the child that pray always. Even is in a band, which they go about singing and dancing. But what the Bible is saying about Cornelius, when it's time for Cornelius to be, he will leave them and go and pray. And that time, I believe there was no phone. The one that is not at home, and Bible still recorded it that all his household, they fear God. That means, I believe Cornelius' wife too, she must be the type that what? That fears God. And the man has passed the thing to him. Say, you have to look after the household. But God will help us. Some of us, we have the fear of God. And the wife, we don't have it. So why we have it? Some husband, they are what? They are lying. They want to destroy the wife. God will help us in Jesus' name. Look at verse 3. He saw in a vision, evidently, about the ninth hour of the day, an angel of God called me in to him and said unto him, Cornelius, what do you <laughs> The angel called Cornelius by what? By name. When last have they called you by name? When last did you hear the voice of God say, my son, Elijah, when last? That was the angel appeared and called Cornelius by name. By name. And look at it. And when he looked on him, he was afraid. He saw the angel live. And said, What is it, Lord? And he said unto him, Thy prayer and the hand have come up for a memorial before me. That what you are doing, they've come into what? Into remembrance before me. I am praying for you. Your prayer, your giving, will come into memorial before God in the name of Jesus. You will not just give, but God will remember your offering today and bless you more than your expectation in the name of Jesus. And look at verse 5. Say, and now send men to Joppa and call for one Simon, whose son name is Peter. He lodged with one, one Simon, a tanner, whose house is by the sea side. He shall tell thee what thou ought to do. Amen. <laughs> and Bible says, and when the angel which spake unto Cornelius was departed, he called to his household servant and a devout soldier of them. That wait on wait, waited on him continually. And when he had declared all these things unto them, he sent them to what to Job to go and hear Peter. Can you imagine? God wants to bless somebody, and God appeared to him. So all you are doing is time for me to what to recompense and to repay you back. Physically, open vision. Huh? Open vision. It was not in a dream. The angel appeared. Let me show this, then we'll go into a prayer. We we'll continue from there another day. The day I don't know. We're still talking about answer me by voice. I'll share it before. That time I walking on the ground. And I, there was no cars at that time. So some people would drop me at because uh, I live in Clapton Pond. I always take bus nights, early in the morning, three, four sometimes. But I've got this colleague that would drop me at uh, Dustin Junction. This particular day, I think it was it was five that we go to late, you know, it was eight, I can't remember. So it was eight, eh? Five. Is it five? No, no, no five. Five years from, from Canada. I think it was 48, 48. Then the boss just came and we're all rushing. And I was the last person, nobody was there again. And as I was going in, I just felt a hand behind me. And I look back and I saw the old man. And everything freezed. And the man spoke to me. And say something which I will not tell you. And he said, he said those things. And I look at it and I say, Thank you, sir. Then the thing, I came back to my senses again, entered into the car, expecting the man to follow me. Then I look back, nobody again. And the vehicle started at that time and we moved. And what the man said, some are just manifesting this year, 2022. I'm talking about, let me see, yeah, yeah. 20, uh, uh, 
talking about 17 years ago. And he says, he touched me and I look back, I saw him. When I shared with some of my, uh, my uh, colleagues, uh, what should I call them? Some pastor, uh, some pastor's uh, friend in the church that time. Uh, they were, what do we call ourselves? Some of them were not pastor, we were all working for God. And they said, one even asked me, the one that spoke to you, was he a white man or a black one? I said, what do you want to do with that one? He said, if he's a black man, he may not be an angel. Rise up on your feet. <laughs> He's looking for a white angel. <laughs> Beloved, he spoke to me, and what he said has been manifested, but some of them, this <laughs> day, some of them came into light, life and light. Uh, if you want to know, uh, come and bribe me there, I will share what he says. If I'm not a, <laughs> if you are ready to bribe me, I will tell you what I will take. At least I can charge you for that. It's my secret you want to know. And when you want to know the secret, I mean, go to Coca-Cola and ask them for their secret. Huh? That means you want to buy the whole company. Uh, you want to buy me too. So that one is not, it's not part of what God has me to share with you. But if you want to, <laughs> we, don't, we want to pray. I'm only joking. If you want to know, I will tell you. A little bit we want to pray. We're still talking about answer me by voice, oh Lord. Last week we talked about dream, we talked about, about the word of God. We we'll talk about what open vision and face-to-face -face discussion. And that's the reason you are going to pray. Let's pray and see what we can do within the next 10 minutes. God is here and his presence is here. Beloved, this one is not just any prayer. We are praying prayers that can change your life and that can change my life. Beloved, I am not here there. Paul said, look, I am not here there. I'm still aiming to attain that great height. I am not there uh, to you. You will be there. Ah, ah, no, 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 I know where I'm going and I will get it in Jesus' name. You are saying, man, you are not saying your own. Ah, I don't know where you are going, though. why I'm going to some way. And I told you something, where God is very sending, you are going to get it very soon. This is the first prayer you are going to pray. Decree loud and clear. Beloved, you won't go to talk to you face to face and already you have veil covering your eyes. You have scale in your eyes. Decree and pray. Say any spiritual scale, any spiritual scale in my eyes, come out by fire in the name Jesus. Come out, 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 Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Beloved, if one is blind physically, you don't have any problem. You have things that can hate you. Now, I'm not saying it will be easy, but the one that is what is spiritual blindness. That general of Christ, of blessed memory, Baba or Badari. Physically, Baba could not see. But when it comes to spiritual things, often now some people are still going about with all the prophecy given to them by Baba. Baba won many souls, even more than those with two eyes. We're talking about what? <laughs> Having spiritual eyes. Yes. I had a story that Baba built a house and built a voice. Baba said to God, said, look, I've built a house. I've built a house. Am I not going to see? At least, let me see. I guess you want to see. That's to tell you, you know that uh, something people don't understand. Uh, and they said, God opened my eyes. And my father saw the house. I said, ah, it's beautiful. And before my father could say, Jack, God closed the eyes again. I said, I have my reason. It's like Paul. He complained to God. He said, Father, when are you going to take this affliction away? This turn in my flesh, when are you going to take What did Jesus say to him? He said, My grace is sufficient for you. There are things that that is how God wanted to be. That you can't query God. They said God opened my eyes and he saw the house, the new house. And within a few minutes again, God closed the back. Just to tell him, I can't do it, but I'm ready to do it. Decree and pray for yourself. Say, spiritual blindness. I am no longer your candidate. <laughs> pray for yourself. Thank God we are in the season of our prayer and fasting. I know you've received enough strength. Pray for yourself. Say, spiritual blindness. I am no longer your candidate. 
Therefore, depart now in the name of Jesus. Yes. Yes. I refuse to operate. Yes. With spiritual blindness. I refuse. I refuse. I, re I receive my spiritual sight now. Yes, I receive. I receive. I receive my spiritual sight. I receive it now. I receive. I receive. I receive, I receive, I receive, I receive, I receive. In Jesus' name we pray. Pray the third one, decree loud and clear. Say, oh God, oh God, and heal me of spiritual blindness. In the name of Jesus, heal me, heal me, heal me, heal me, heal me. All spiritual blindness, heal me. Heal me, 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 heal me. In Jesus' name we pray. Pray the next one, beloved. That was the reason they've been feeding some of us. I'm not talking the one in the dream. Some of us have been going to that place. I've mentioned it before. You know, by that time. If you see where this one was selling this rice and dodo, uh, you will look back and say, ah, why did I go there? And people will be coming from governor service, from a to come and be buy in this uh, sink shop. How about the day I went there? A friend took me there and, and we bought the rice. I wasn't passed off, but by his grace, I wasn't born again. But by his grace, I could see even without one again. The thing has been there, but nobody to mentor me. I didn't even know I've got anything. I will only be telling myself, my friend, say, look, I'm using praying. And I'll be grabbing wish, grabbing familiar spirits. Say, you, you are wish. You, you are this. I wasn't going to church. I wasn't going to mosque. But when we got there, we bought the rice. When I tasted it, I said to him, I said, look, is this the reason people are coming? He said, what is she selling? He said, there's nothing here. I said, I'm not, not eating again. And I cannot buy this one. Until many years later, not only the woman has been using blood of all the small, small children in the area to be cooking with it, until she confessed. And people be leaving off a jai, off a jaya button. People be coming from Alausa. The case, they put it on newspaper at that time. Uh, was it Yaris or something like that? Until she confessed that she was using. They, all they knew that time was that little, little girls and boys would be dying in that area. No, no, she was using their blood to cook the rice. And people were rushing. Uh, both of them, you know, when you show and even governor, we asked them to come and buy. That's the reason we need. Uh, if you love that food too much, and you don't know the person that is cooking it, go and check yourself. That, that uh, Yarika will call it Mama Puts. The day she says, what is mama put? And I say, okay, put more, put this one. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> even with all my experience in Lagos, I never even know the meaning of mama put, or she mentioned it one day. You can't leave that mama put. That's where you are with it. And the, after finishing, you don't even know what you've eaten. You better share it very well. Decree loud and clear and pray for yourself. Say, oh God, Allah, and heal me of my spiritual blindness tonight. Joseph, 
and when Joseph became what? A prime minister. Apart from dreaming, Joseph could what? Interpret dream again. He has God a gift. If you are dreaming and it's coming to pass, and you don't know the interpretation, you can still go to God and say, Lord, I don't just want to be dreaming. I want to be interpreted. It was interpretation of dream that turned who? Joseph, the prime minister. Just interpretation. That's what the Bible says. A gift of a man. Eh? We make a way for him. And that gift, we make him to sit among special people, not just ordinary people. Beloved, when you have it, you have it. Don't, don't, eh, I've said it before. That's car. We all can fly there without touching each other. I'm ready, if you are a member of us here, I'm ready to just I want you to exercise it. Moses said, How I wish all of us can touch what? To prophet. So that we can be prophesying. Yes. Don't let anybody key your gifts. If you have people that don't appreciate your gifts, run away from them. Look for people that we are that we what that we are to groom it and that we appreciate it. Let's pray to more. And decree loud that prayer. Say any power. Manipulating my dream. Manipulating my uh, dream. Uh, the day your dream is supposed to turn to channel of divine revelation, that's when they will be bringing all this thing. That's when you will be seeing yourself wearing your nursery school clothes. That's where you will be seeing yourself dancing. You will see yourself in, uh, you've done cultural dance before, and you will now see yourself putting on that clothes. You're not between your leg like this. Ah, well, I'm one day, you are day. Eh? Ah, well, I'm one day, you are day. Yeah, there you go, we have people. Are you thinking we have those? Ah, then you don't want me to go and join Nollywood again. Which Nollywood at what age? Eh? You want to go into sin again? <laughs> he said, instead of you to say, I buy the spirit behind, <laughs> behind that one, you are supposed to be a prophetess. You are supposed to be a what? A prophet, and I see yourself dancing. Let's pray so that I can leave it. Two more. See, any power, any, power. any evil, personality, evil personality manipulating my dream, manipulating. be buried tonight in the name of Jesus. Be buried tonight. Be buried. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. This is the last one because of what I we are still talking about. Answer me by voice, oh Lord. Answer me by voice. We'll continue another day. This is not ordinary message. This is a message or a teaching that can change one's destiny and one's life. Because uh, if you can get it right spiritually, you know, all other things that just Little thing. All you need to, to get right is get it right spiritually. Know when to move, know when not to move, know what to do, know what not to do. Before, before you know, you will get results. That's the problem. We are only gambling. That's sister said she saw herself. Well, that's us. And she too was gambling with them. And I've been telling her, say, look, all these things you are doing, they are not meant for you. Until she now got to that point and discovered that all she has been doing was nothing but what? For gambling. Because they say that job is giving people one does not mean that is your own what? Your own destiny or your way of life. No, it doesn't work like that. Your own may be to be doing little, little things and you'll be getting results more than those one waking up six and only yet ask her. You'll be somewhere and God will bless you. I'm not saying it should not work, but get it right. Do the right thing. And before you know, you will see yourself at the top. Eh? If you are not meant to be to be serving people, to be carrying fire, to be doing all this, and you say that is where I'm going to that, you know, God will not force anybody. Our daddy, or should we call him great, great, great daddy? Daddy Adam has caused problem. So when God gave Daddy Adam Eve, I said, Why did you do this? Did I ask you for a while? So that time we he moved us to uh, Matthew 7 7. Say, ask. And he said, If you don't ask him, he'll be looking at you. When the uh, book of Joshua, when they, they got to Gibeon and they did not ask God, and the phone coming out with people that go ask them to keep the gospel, they were the ones that suffered. God, will, 
Nothing will move God. Whether you get it right, or you, or you, or you, you got it wrong. It's not, that's not, yes. Even if God asks you to be working for you and you say, yes, I'm too big to work for God. There is no vacuum in the work of God. Before you even decide not to do anything, he has already raised 20, 30 people that will replace you. Yeah. Sir? What do you share? Ele do mare, maje she o. Ele do mare, nebukadinesari she o. O de ron ko inu ibo o. Maje she o. Ele do mare. Ah. God is more than somebody who can say, eh, eh, I'm not going to do it again. Oh. Let's pray the last prayer. Decree loud that prayer. Some people believe they are working for pastor. Thank God for our own church. We're all doing it together. And the goal we are working for, very soon we compensate us. I am very sure of that. Look, it's a confidence. Thank God for your lives. I will say it in your presence, and I will always say it at your back. I always tell people, I'm there, I'm not there. My people, yes, they are doing it. And God will bless all of you in Jesus' name. God will surprise all of you. For the Lord, we are showing towards his work. Look, sometimes we, I'll just sit down and be crying. Say, God, please bless these people. They are doing it with their heart. And I'm praying for you openly now. My God and your God will bless you. Hey, all of us say, no, we don't know. People that are there, they don't know what they are missing. But here is a what? It's a family house. Those that will cause problems before they come, God will, God will use bongo to eat their head. They will not even come in. Pray the last prayer. Say, oh, God, arise. And turn my dream life to channel of divine revelation in the name of Jesus. Turn my dream life. Yes, to channel of divine revelation. I don't just want to be dreaming. I want it to become revelation. Pray that prayer, beloved. Pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Our Father, we thank you for tonight's ministration. We bless your holy name. Lord, and we pray for your servant that you use. Lord, we pray that you feel him afresh in the name of Jesus. Lord, we pray that you continue to manifest in his life in, like never before in the name of Jesus. Your hand of great grace and, and anointing, let your rest mightily upon you in the name of Jesus. Unto you be of the glory, O Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Children of God, it's time for tithe and offering. If God has laid it upon your heart to give to this commission, our account is well displayed on the screen. God bless you. Lord, this is just a token out of what you've given unto us. Lord, accept it, bless it, and replenish us in the mighty name of Jesus. Don't let us have good things in the name of Jesus. Lord, in this period, sustain us in the mighty name of Jesus. Unto be all the glory. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for everything you have done. Amen. This is Fire of a Crime Ministry. We meet here every Sunday from 9.15 to 12.30 p.m. And every Tuesday, like this, is our revival hour from hour of 6 30 p.m to 8 30 and every third friday of each month is our night between night of all possibilities and saturdays from 9 p.m to 10 p.m is our program hour of its faithfulness for any friday that will have night video that's the following saturday we won't be having the hour of its faithfulness and every first sunday of each month is our thanksgiving sunday and every last Sunday of each month is our Deliverance Sunday. And our Children's Deliverance Program Sunday is a bi-monthly program. Next one is coming up in December by His Grace. And Children of God, we started our, our 21 days fasting and prayer. We started October, then seven days. November, we started this morning. So for the next seven days, the prayers um, list is
on the was is on our WhatsApp group or on um, a father in the Lord um, uh, Facebook. Um, so, and the next in December, from the first of December till the seventh of December is going to be the the third one for this year, making twenty one days. God bless you as you join us in the name of Jesus. Children of God, we pray. And but before we go, let us pray one prayer point. Open your mouth and begin to thank the Lord. The Lord, this is a new month, month of November. This is what I would like you to do for me. Lord, surprise me. These are my requests. I am in the new month. Don't let me be disgraced. Do not pass me by in this month, this month of November. Surprise me. Visit me, O oh Lord. Let this month be a special month in my life. Do that which only you can do in my life this month. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Our Father, we thank you. From the beginning of today's service to how far you helped us, be that exalted in the name of Jesus. We thank you for what you have done in our, in our lives collectively and individually. Lord, we thank you. We magnify your holy name. Accept our thanks and praises in Jesus' name. Children of God, I pray for you and I pray for myself. Today being the first day of, of the month, in the month of November, God will over answer our prayers in the name of Jesus. This month shall be a special month in our life in the name of Jesus. All our requests shall be answered by fire this month in the name of Jesus. In this particular month, November 2022, mercy will speak for us in the name of Jesus. Grace will favor us in the name of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, this month, God will not pass us by in the name of Jesus. In this particular month, people will gather around us to celebrate with us in the name of Jesus. This particular month, November, our story will change in the name of Jesus. We shall bear the new name in the name of Jesus. Reproach shall be the things of the past in our lives in the name of Jesus. I cover you all with the blood of Jesus. I pray for our children. Lord, let it be well with them in the name of Jesus. Among their contemporaries, let them excel in the name of Jesus. Anointing of excellence, anointing of champion shall be their lot in the name of Jesus. We shall not bury any one of them in the name of Jesus. In this particular month, till Jesus starts, no evil visitors will visit our homes in the name of Jesus. People will not gather around us to mourn with us in the name of Jesus. We cover every one of us with the blood of Jesus. Lord, we pray for Fire Free Crime Ministry International. This ministry continue to be connected to the throne of grace in the name of Jesus. This ministry continue to exhibit the signs and wonders from heaven in the mighty name of Jesus. We pray for our Father in the Lord and his household. He continues to be well with him and his household in the name of Jesus. This particular month, November 2022, shall favor him in the name of Jesus, shall favor his household in the name of Jesus, shall favor his commission in the name of Jesus. Lord, we pray that your hand or your hand of unusual mercy, your hand of unusual grace, lay, lay that hand upon him, upon his household and his commission in the name of Jesus. We combine in his household with the blood of Jesus. Lord, we pray for Nigeria. Let it be well with Nigeria in the name of Jesus. Pass through the land of Nigeria in the name of Jesus. The land of UK, we commit it to your hand. Lord, pass through this nation in the name of Jesus. Have mercy upon the land of United Kingdom in the name of Jesus. Recession going all over and around the world. Lord, intervene and have mercy upon every one of us in the name of Jesus. In the land of U U Ukraine, Lord, intervene in the affairs in the name of Jesus. The strong man behind the invitation, invasion, disgrace him in the name of Jesus. Lord, concerning the whole world, have mercy upon the whole world. Let your mercy intervene upon behalf of the whole world in the name of Jesus. Lord, have mercy upon us, O oh Lord. One more time, Lord, have mercy upon the whole world in the name of Jesus. Lord, have mercy upon the whole world in the name of Jesus. Lord, as we come back here next this week Sunday, Lord, let us come back with a garment of praise in the name of Jesus. Let us come back with a song of hallelujah in our mouth in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. In our sleep tonight, in your mercy and in your compassion, manifest yourself in our lives in the name of Jesus. Let us have divine encounter with you in the mighty name of Jesus. Unto you be all the glory, O Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. Shall we share the grace in fellowship? May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet spirit of Holy Ghost be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, God, goodness, and mercy shall follow us 
all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Let us declare Psalm 118, verse 17. I shall not die but live to declare the works of the Lord in the land of the living. I shall not die but live to declare the works of the Lord in the land of the living. The thought and let us include every member of our household, every member of this commission, and those connected to us, and all our loved ones. We shall not die but live to declare the works of the Lord in the land of the living. Amen. Let us shout to hallelujah unto our God. Hallelujah. 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 God bless you all.